Okay, after the initial fitting, what I discovered was that the belt that I was using, which was this one, it gave us a lot of length here, about a three quarters of an inch more. And I made this match, so we ended up with an inch to inch and a half more distance. And once I got to fooling around with it, you'll see that all the way out, a single step of these motors, because they're only 20 step motors, 20 steps per turn, a single step, look it out there at the end, there's a lot of travel there. So the resolution, first step, pretty bad way out there. So what I did was uh, just use this other belt, this nice yellow belt, and I just had to shorten this piece, slide the adjuster down, wasn't that big of a deal. And so now we're about uh, two and three eighths uh, center to center on those shafts, and then I made this to match. So cut down on our space, but still we'll be able to get a pretty good little drawing area. Certainly, you know, three by five or something like that. We'll figure it out once we get it stationary and start running things. So I think it's going to look neat. It's going to work just fine. It's just not, you know, when you draw curves, you're going to see some some jagged lines in there. Maybe we just need to use a big fat marker instead of, well, anyway, we'll figure it out.